Well, today, shortly after one o'clock, the uh, 911 center got a got a call of what they were described to as an active shooter out here at Wesleyan College. Uh, we immediately went into our active res shooter response. Uh, deputies uh, immediately responded. Uh, because of their quick response, they were able to encounter a suspect uh, here behind the Monroe building on campus. Uh, our preliminary investigation has revealed that it seems to have been some type of domestic situation that this individual was coming onto campus uh, to talk to or locate one of his family members. Now, we don't know what his intentions were uh, with that family member, but we do know that there was some uh, uh, domestic uh, situations going on in this uh, particular household. Uh, this person came to the campus. Uh, there was word spread that uh, there was an armed person on the campus. Uh, we immediately responded. The deputies uh, quickly found uh, a suspect. He is in custody at this time. Uh, the truck behind us is being uh, looked at. Uh, that's the truck that we believe that the suspect came in. Uh, the uh, the uh, EOD uh, uh, canines uh, alerted on some on a package in the truck. They're looking through it. Uh, the truck uh, is of a uh, tree service company and it may be some fertilizer or something uh, like that. But just in, uh, in the abundance of caution, uh, the EOD uh, folks are checking it out to see, uh, make sure that there's nothing uh, harmful in the vehicle. So did he actually have a gun or? We've not found a firearm at this time. Uh, when he was uh, found, he did have a pocket knife, but we're, we're sort of looking uh, to make sure that uh, a, a gun wasn't ditched or anything like that.